Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem to find the value of square root of i. Now, solution. First, in the first step, as we know that i square is equal to negative 1. So, i is equal to, when we apply square root in both sides, it will be plus or minus square root of negative 1. Now, let's suppose this square root of i is equal to a plus b i. So, first we'll be find the value of a and b, so as we can get the value of square root of i. Now, to remove this square root, we'll square in both sides. So, from this side, which is square root of i, we'll square in this side is equal to this side, which is a plus b i, also into this side, we square it. So, this square root will cancel square, then it will be i is equal to, from this side here, is in the form of the rule. So, here we'll apply, therefore, we'll apply the rule, which is a plus b bracket square which is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab so by applying this form a square it will be this a square so a bracket square then plus b square it will be bi bracket square so bi bracket square then plus 2ab it will be 2a bracket b so it will be here b it will be this b i so bracket b i bracket then it will be i is equal to a square plus we'll take the square inside so to be b square i square then plus 2 we we'll open this bracket so it will be 2 a b i then in the next step it will be i is equal to a square then plus b square i square it is this negative one so here bracket negative one bracket plus two a b i then it will be i is equal to a square negative one times b square it will be negative b square then plus this two a b i then from here a square minus b square this is real and this, because it has i, this is imaginary, same as this imaginary. So, for this rule, here we place bracket. So, for this rule, it is zero, because into this side, rule, we have imaginary only. We don't have real. So, to be zero, then plus i, which is this, zero plus i, it is i, is equal to this a square minus b square bracket, then plus 2 a b here you can place bracket here i outside the bracket so here this real a square minus b square will compare with this zero and for imaginary this here this is same as one i so one i will compare with this imaginary here so it will be this is equal to zero so a square minus b square is equal to zero and for imaginary this is equal to 1i so 2ab bracket i is equal to this 1i then in the next step from here i this i will cancel this i so it will be 2ab is equal to 1 then we divide by 2a in both sides so this and this will cancel then it will be b is equal to 1 over to a so from here b is equal to 1 over 2a into this side with b we have b so it will be a square minus b we substitute this so 1 over 2a bracket square is equal to 0 then it will be a square minus 1 square it is 1 over 2a square it will be 4a square is equal to 0 then this is same as over 1 so there is m here of 1 and 4a square it is 4a square 4a square divided by 1 it is 4a square times a square it will be 
a power of 4 4 a square so here minus 4 a squared divided by 4 a squared is 1 1 times 1 is 1 is equal to 0 then this is same as 0 over 1 so we'll cross multiply then it will be this times 1 it is this 4 a power of 4 minus 1 is equal to 4 a squared times 0 it is 0 then we'll take negative 1 to this side so it will be 4 I mean 4a power of 4 is equal to this to take to this side to be 1 then we divide by 4 in both sides so this and this will cancel then it will be a power of 4 is equal to 1 over 4 then in the next step to remove this power of 4 will power in both sides by 1 over 4 so from this side which is a power of 4 bracket will power by 1 over 4 is equal to this side 1 over 4 also in this side will power by 1 over 4 so this and this will cancel so to be a power of 1 it is a is equal to will take power of 1 over 4 in the numerator and the denominator so 1 power of 1 over 4 it is 1 over in the denominator to be 4 power of 1 over 4 now 4 is same as 2 square then bracket this power of 1 over 4 so it will be a is equal to here by 1 here by 2 so it will be 1 over 2 power of a half is same as square root of 2 so it will be plus or minus square root of 2 so we already get the value of a now to get this value of b from here b is equal to 1 over 2a so from b is equal to 1 over 2a then it will be b is equal to 1 over 2a same as 1 divided by 2a so it will be b is equal to 1 divided by 2a a it is this plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 so here bracket a it is plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 bracket then it will be b is equal to 1 divided by 2 2 is same as square root of 2 times square root of 2 then bracket plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 bracket now from this square root of 2 cancel this square root of 2 so it will be b is equal to 1 divided by 2 times 2 times plus or minus 1 so here it will be plus or minus square root of 2 this one so here bracket like this then 1 divided by this is same as b is equal to 1 divided by this is same as times 1 over plus or minus square root of 2 so it will be b is equal to 1 times this it will be 1 over plus or minus square root of 2 then we recall before we let that square root of i is equal to a plus b i so from we recall square root of i is equal to a plus b i so it will be square root of i is equal to a a it is this so plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 then plus b i so it will be plus or minus b it is this so 1 over square root of 2 i so this is the final answer of square root of i in this our problem plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 plus or minus 1 over square root of 2 i thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video Bye-bye.